Now, does having a financial advisor make a difference in investor confidence? A new report done back in uh, April and May of this year found that less than a quarter of them had a financial plan or advisor. About three in five worry monthly, weekly, even daily about their finances. And just over 40% believe they may run out of money. But uh, if you have a financial advisor, the survey found that more than 70% were confident they wouldn't run out of money. And three in four who had an annuity believe their money would, in fact, last their lifetime. So, guys, what do you think? Would you say that one of the greatest benefits financial planning offers is confidence in a person's financial future? I think the, if you look at the stats, I mean, the numbers kind of speak for themselves. Obviously, as financial professionals, we're biased and think that it's a great idea to work with a professional when planning out your financial future. But it does take a lot of confidence. To me, I don't know about you guys, but to me, I think one of the biggest values a financial professional can have is going back to what we were talking about earlier, is a helping avoid an investor making that emotional decision. You know, I think, you know, when times are easy and the market's going up, you know, those are good times for us and for clients. But it's times like what we're experiencing now in the market where we want to have really good communication with our clients. We want to talk to them, make sure they understand what they own, you know, walk them through that process so they can have confidence in their financial plan. Sometimes I talk about it as like talking them off the cliff. Would agree. Yeah, that's uh, common in, in times like this. We talked about emotions earlier. Couldn't be more emotional than a time like this. You know, the way I look at it, what a financial advisor is, it's a partnership with a client where they are hand in hand. I always say to my clients, I know that our relationship is working the way that it should. If you come to me and say, I don't know if you can help me with this, but when, when things look like this, when times are tough, it's our job to be there with you. If you call, we answer the phone. Um, we make sure that we are reaching out to you whenever something changes in the news just so that you know how or if it affects you. And one of the cool things about uh, America's retirement headquarters is we tailor every individual client's plan to them. So it's not just some sort of cookie cutter box that we try to fit you in. Everyone has their own plan. We, we follow certain formulas but we're there, it's a partnership, and we're talking to you, and we're, we're working through this with you. This affects us in a lot of the same ways that it affects you. Yeah, when you think about it, is it worth getting a financial advisor? You talk about that team approach that we have at America's Retirement Headquarters. The decisions you make with your investments are gonna impact things like your healthcare costs. You know, the decisions that you make with your investments are gonna impact things like taxes. You know, one of the things that we've done is kind of bring it all together to make sure that you have all of the same people, all on the same page, working to accomplish that end goal for each individual client and their unique approach. Something else I think that is uh, important on why it's good to work with a financial professional is just looking out for blind spots. Uh, if you've ever been driving down the road and you know all of a sudden you kind of get you know, focused on where you're going. Sometimes you don't notice what's happening around you. I know that more than once I've uh, either been in the car, my you know wife is driving or I've been driving and all of a sudden you hear somebody say, watch out, you know, there's a car that's merging that you weren't paying attention. You didn't see that car coming over. And had you not noticed that or had you not been aware of that, it could have resulted in a deadly accident. And if we think about it, a lot of times people are just cruising down their retirement journey and thinking things are every, everything's going to be fine. They may not be aware of blind spots that are, you know, happening out there. I can think of, again, more times where I've driven and somebody has one of those toe straps and it's just flapping off the back of their car. And if you've seen some of those things, you know that if it gets wrapped around that wheel well, uh, nothing good is going to happen. There's nothing good. And it takes an advisor to tell you about some of those blind spots to make sure you don't get wiped out or get into a deadly accident, especially when you're dealing with your retirement, because retirement is a point in your life that doesn't allow the luxury of time for making mistakes. No do-overs. Exactly there, right. You can't, you can't turn it back. There really are no do-overs. And, you know, the final thing is, is looking at missed opportunities. You know, they say you don't know what you don't know. Um, I know that uh, so many times we've been talking to people about what we were referring to in our previous segment, which was lazy assets. And of course, if you ever miss any of our previous segments in uh, the section below, you can always just 
take a look at all of our videos that we have over on our YouTube channel, you know, where we talk about things like how to invest in a bear market or where there are different opportunities. But when we look at different opportunities, can you think about maybe a couple of different examples of where, you know, you've gone through a process and people thought, well, maybe I had everything taken care of, but there was some missed opportunities that were out there. I can certainly think of a couple, but any uh, that jump to your guys' mind? Well, first of all, you, you had mentioned uh, annuities earlier, fixed annuities, and, you know, products change all the time. Uh, it's, it's, it's a challenge to keep up with all the changes, but that's part of our job. That's part of our calling. That's one of the things we take pride in doing. Uh, and we work as a team. That's another uh, a plus in our, in our column, I guess, in that we talk to each other about what's going on out there in the market. And it's a conversation every day. It's not just haphazard. You know, we intentionally try to keep up with what's going on and make sure our clients are getting where they want to go as well. You know, it's, it's, it's not a roll of the dice. It's intentional. It is. It's definitely an intentional planning process. When we think about missed opportunities uh, at our economic summit we just recently held at the Hilton Gardens, we were talking about the biggest threats and opportunities that are facing retirees. And when we think about opportunities, you know, one of the opportunities to take a look at right now as we're getting closer and closer towards the end of the year is, have you done your end of the year tax plan yet? And if not, this is an area that us at America's Retirement Headquarters can help you with. And or you can, you know, again, reach out to your tax professional. We're not accountants or CPAs. But it, if you think about it, this year we've experienced a lot of volatility in the stock market. And for most folks that are listening, their retirement account is either their biggest or second biggest asset that they own. And, you know, with that retirement account, what happens is they haven't paid taxes on that money until they begin to take withdrawals out. So if you look at your investment accounts and your investment accounts are down this year because the market and the overall economy are down a little bit. The question is, is do you feel that your family's tax rates will be higher in the future than what they are today? And if we look at the out of control spending, you know, the first time in the history of our United States, <laughs> our U.S. debt has now gone over $31 trillion with the out of control spending, you know, with everything that's happening right now, it may make sense for you to take a look at doing things like a Roth conversion, looking at ways in addition to that to detaxify your retirement account to get ahead of it. So that way, if and when things come back in the future, you've paid your taxes while the balance is lower. So end of the year tax planning is again, another one of those missed opportunities that folks can take advantage of. So at the end of the day, if you haven't heard from somebody in a little while, could be a good opportunity to have a conversation to say, you know, what are the threats and what are the opportunities? And I think that's by working with a financial professional, what you get. It's a lot like having a, uh, I think most of us hopefully have a fire extinguisher in our kitchen. You know, it's not something that we want to use, but it's something that when the time comes to use it, we certainly hope it works. It's the same sort of thing when you have a proper investment strategy, you know, when the markets do go sideways. And that's really not a question of if, but a question of when you want to make sure that it works, that the pieces are put in place. So if your financial professional has been, I don't want to say absent, but yeah, for lack of a better term, if, if they've been unavailable, especially this year, why not turn to a team that, again, has been helping countless people, uh, you know, retire and stay retired for over what a combined, I'm going to say 75 years, but I think it might even be more than that. Right, Nolan? Yeah, with Yanis all in the room, you know, we have uh, quite a bit of years of experience and uh, absolutely happy to share that years of experience and wisdom to guide you through the tough times. So whether you're a client or whether you're a first time listener, you know, don't hesitate to pick up the phone and give us a call. So there you go. You know, you're going to retire once. Why not turn to a team that has been helping numerous people uh, in the area retire for you know, years and years of experience. Pick up the phone, give a call, start developing that plan. 419-794-3030. That's 419-794-3030 or online, americasretirementheadquarters.com. There's more to come here on the show, here on America's Retirement Headquarters. Going to step aside for just a second. That conversation continues after this.